I feel like this movement is a movement. And so Occupy Yourself is really just applying what all of the Occupy movements believe together, but applying it to yourself. Like, actually having a, um, like, conviction about it, about it all, I think. Sir? Yes. That when I hear the term Occupy Yourself, I think of uh, soul searching and uh, finding those things that uh, make you self-actualizing. Okay, when I think about the term Occupy Yourself, I automatically think um, educate yourself. Um, obviously, you have to educate yourself on what's going on with the whole Occupy movement, you know, that started on Wall Street. So you have to pretty much learn how it relates to everyone in your own community. So I think um, Occupy Yourself is just educate yourself and figure out what you can do to make a difference, to change things. Um, yeah, I think occupying yourself is, I think when I hear that phrase, I, th I imagine it means um, really um, chilling out and getting to know your own self, knowing who you are from the inside out. And once you do that, I think it, it's um, more possible to understand other people. So yeah, I think that definitely has a lot to do with helping others and really knowing how to deal with issues and understanding who you are so you can understand who other people are. Yeah. All right. Uh, the term occupy yourself, to me it means to know what's going on within yourself, around you, to educate yourself, to be aware of everything that affects you and how it affects others. It also means to help out of your community because your community is a part of yourself to build a community. Um, when I hear the term occupy yourself, I think about um, educating yourself on current issues and uh, knowing what's going on in the world around you. Well, occupy myself uh, to me means that uh, we are here protesting for uh, different things and uh, me myself, I'm part of security out here and um, just trying to make sure everything uh, goes sm smoothly. So uh, when I hear the term occupy yourself, what I think of is how easy it is um, to tell other people what they should be doing, um, whether it is people camped in a park or whether it is rich people or politicians, and how vital it is for us to be educating ourselves on the issues, uh, being active in our communities, um, learning what's important not just to ourselves but also to the communities and neighborhoods that we live in, um, connecting with broader struggles and uh, making ourselves uh, models of the things that we're talking about. When I hear occupy yourself I think of uh, facing yourself uh, kind of like taking charge of responsibilities in your life like not um, repressing anything or holding anything back but being honest with yourself honest with your situation in life and coming to terms with it dealing with it and moving on being progressive um, moving forward and uh, growing in general All right. when I hear occupy yourself I think about what is or at least what should be the bedrock of this movement um, if we're to be successful it has to be more than about protesting Wall Street, but it has to be about um, what sacrifices we're willing to make and the changes that we're willing to undertake in order to ultimately affect change widespread. When I think of Occupy Yourself, I think of educating yourself on the issues so you know what's going on and you really care. And then as you begin to educate yourself on the issues and find out, like, you know, bank bailouts, blah, 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 everything that we're fighting for, and you kind of understand that, that you have no other choice but to go out and try to help others or spread the word and let other people know, like, we need to fight and we have to stand up for what we want. Um, it is not just a selfless thing to me. I think that um, as you begin to pour into yourself and be the, become the best person that you can be, that you can't help but help others. You can't help but spread the word and spread the message of... Um, just self-empowerment and educating yourself and exercising and educating and all those types of things. I think it all goes together. So.